ESPNU and ESPN. We're going to take a look at the official betting previews of um, Western Kentucky and Middle Tennessee State, as well as California and Oregon. I'm Joe Duffy, America's only Grandmaster Sports Handicapper and CEO of OffshoreInsiders.com. Middle Tennessee State is minus 11.5 with a total of 54 in their game against Western Kentucky. Now, Western Kentucky does have a huge advantage in turnover ratio by eight. And again, we're going to look at the key numbers that are exploited by the world's professional gamblers. To contrast yards per rush on offense, a preeminence from an arithmetical standpoint goes to MTSU by 1.0. Passing yards per completion is another yardstick consumed by the sports investors and the lead is owned by the Red Raiders by one in uh, 1.8. Perhaps the most made use of numbers by certified gamblers is the yards per point overlooked by the square players. From an offensive examination, the better integers are in the column of Middle Tennessee State by 5.9. Insofar as key records on the defensive side of the ball, yards per rush says the healthier run defense is Middle Tennessee State by 0.3. The better quality passing yards per completion on defense gives the upper hands to Middle Tennessee State by 0.5. In terms of yards per point, the better defense, MTSU by 0.3. Now, for those of you who are listening to our podcast for the first time, yards per point is determined by dividing the total number of yards by points. Offensively, a lower number is considered a more efficient one. On defense, the higher number is better. You get offshoreinsiders.com, you get all the best spread picks for tonight, but the best is from the best. God's Tips, the winningest sports service of all time, an anchor of offshoreinsiders.com, says it's not a high-profile game by any means, but WKU and Middle Tennessee State side and total, clearly the biggest plays on the board. Why you get the in-depth analysis at offshoreinsiders.com, where you also get the biggest plays on California, Oregon. Now, here are some spread betting trends. All records are ATS. Hilltoppers are 8-2 as underdogs, 7-3 and three versus an opponent with a losing record. The Red Raiders are 29 off of a straight-up win, but they've dropped 5 of 6 as favorites. Some over-under trends, Middle Tennessee State has gone over 6 straight, excluding pushes. You want the hard copy of this, just go to offshoreinsiders.com, take a look at the left rail, and then we do link to the free picks and sports betting news and notes. That'll take you to scoresoddspicks.com slash news. But smarter thing, just to streamline it, go to offshoreinsiders.com, and every single link you need is on that page. California and Oregon numbers now. This game is on ESPN. The Vegas and offshore odds are Oregon minus 23 and a half with a total of 63 yards per carry. The higher rated offense is Oregon by a whopping 3.1. On the same side of the scrimmage, yards per reception gives the upper hand of the Golden Bears by 2.4. Sharp football betters exploit that yards per point. And the more productive unit with the ball in their hands is Oregon by 1.2. And stopping rushing attacks, the higher rated defense of carding to rushing yards is California by 1.1. The stinger defense in terms of yards per catch would be Oregon by 1.5. The more disruptive defense in making use of yards per point is that of Oregon, forcing 3.0 more. On the better side of the turnover ratio is California by 2. Now, some spread betting trends where all records are ATS, but by the way, the biggest pick on this game is at offshoreinsiders.com, and it's the key play of the day. As a humongous play on the under, the key play of the day is the most collaborated single daily best bet in the history of sports betting. Go to offshoreinsiders.com. Just click on the key play of the day link on the uh, front page, and you will see all the cooperation that goes behind this pick. Of course, when you buy the play, you're going to see it specified. Why? This total is the best play on the board, baseball or football side or total. Spread betting trends. Again, I remind you all records are ATS. California 20-6 and six is an underdog of 10.5 or greater. They're 20-8 and eight after accumulating more than 280 yards passing in the previous game, but 
to 7 and 19 their last 26 on the road. Oregon is 9 and 3 off of a bye week, but they're 28 and 12 after accumulating less than 170 yards passing in the previous game, and they are 3 and 8 to teams with a winning record. Some over under trends. Oregon over 16 and 4 as road favorites, over 22 and 8 after allowing more than 450 total yards in their previous game. Again, even if you decide to bet on your own, the best free information is at offshoreinsiders.com. It includes links to the official sports betting Twitter feed, f- uh, Facebook page, and a whole lot more. All kinds of free information at offshoreinsiders.com. <laughs> 